Hello friends, welcome to Easy Homemade Projects. In today's video, I will show you that how I made this digital petrol pump machine using Arduino and flow sensor. This video is sponsored by PCBOA. They provide PCB manufacturing and assembly services. You can order 10 pieces of high quality PCBs within $5 only. For the new members, the first order of 10 PCBs is free. They also support multiple payment and shipping methods, so you can choose anyone according to your budget. To order your PCBs, just go to their website and make an instant quotation. You can change some more PCB parameters here. You can also select any PCB color from here according to your desire. And after that click on calculate. Now upload your Gerber files here and submit your order. After a few days I received our circuit boards from PCBOA. Here is the box let me open it and show you our new circuit boards. Here are our printed circuit boards along with these stickers and a nice quality pen. As you can see the build quality of these circuit boards is really good as always. These are all the components that are required to complete this control board circuit. This is 1N4007 diode, 3 1 kilo ohm resistors, BC547 transistor, 4 terminal blocks, 8 tactile switches, a 12 volt relay, 2 5mm LEDs, 8 10 kilo ohm resistors and these PCBs. Now let me solder all these components to this control board PCB. This small PCB is a kind of Arduino Mega Shield. I will tell you later about it. I will fix the PCB on our machine like this. So I am going to solder all the buttons and LEDs on the back side of the PCB.
so guys our control board circuit is now complete now I'm going to connect these two PCBs using these wires So guys our control board circuit is now complete. I connected 8 heater pins here, 2 here and 4 here to make connection with Arduino. Here are all the components that are required to make our petrol pump machine. This is a 10 mm plastic tube. This is 6 mm plastic tube. Arduino Mega. This is a 2.8 inches TFT LCD display shield. This is a 12 volt solenoid valve. This is a flow sensor. Here is a 12 volt water pump. And this is our control board circuit. I made this casing using cardboard. Now I'm going to install all these components to this casing. We will connect solenoid valve here and water pump wires here. This is the 12 volt input terminal for the battery and this is the 12 volt output terminal for the Arduino power supply. We will connect our sensor wires here.
सो गाइज आवर पेट्रोल पम्प मशीन इज़ नाउ ऑलमोस्ट कम्प्लीट आई ऑलरेडी अपलोडेड द आर्डोइनो कोड नाउ एम गोइंग टू मेक ए सिंपल सेटअप टू शो यू द प्रॉपर वर्किंग ऑफ दिस मशीन सो गाइज आवर पेट्रोल पम्प मशीन इज़ नाउ कम्प्लीट नाउ लेट मी पावर इट ऑन By pressing this button, we can change the unit from milliliter to liter. By pressing these four buttons, we can set any value. For example, if I want to set one twenty milliliter, first I will press this button, and then I will press this button two times. As you can see, I selected one twenty milliliter. And when we push the start button, it will automatically start filling. and you will notice the number increments over here we can clear this set point value by pressing this button and this counter value by pressing this button so guys this is the final setup i place this water pump here in a water bowl and this is the output pipe now i am going to select 20 ml first as you can see here i selected 20 ml when i press the start button it will automatically start and you will notice a number increment over here now i am going to select 50 ml So guys that's it for today's video let me tell you one thing that this machine is not 100% accurate you can only build it for demonstration purpose all necessary information about this project you can find in the video description like my this video and share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe